Liberty Business, a leading company in the innovation and technology industry, is taking strides towards shaping the future of business with a captivating talk by a world-renowned speaker and philosopher, Jason Silva. In his talk, Silva explored the latest advancements in technology and how they're transforming the business landscape, paving the way for new opportunities and growth. Here's Marcel Riviere with the story. Liberty Business, the front runners in telecommunications for business, are innovative for impact by flying into the future. They have brought Jason Silva, renowned host and speaker. Well, we're living in an age where disruptive technologies are kind of changing the world every single day. I mean, right now everyone's talking about chat GTP, which is kind of mind-boggling that you can have a conversation with an algorithm that talks to you like it's a person. And yet, in spite of how astounding that is you know just the fact that we created a disruptive technology such as this should give us pause and should force us to kind of celebrate our genius for a moment but what happens is we tend to be very reactive about anything disruptive and we become instantly afraid and for whatever reason fear sells if it bleeds it leads so the fear-based narratives tend to kind of take over the headlines and because we live inside of our narratives, in some sense, these things become like self-fulfilling prophecies. So I'm trying to provide an optimistic narrative about disruptive technologies. 30 linear steps gets you to 30. That's how we tend to think about change. But 30 exponential steps gets you to a billion. So that's why the smartphone in your pocket is a million times cheaper a million times smaller and a thousand times more powerful than what used to be a $60 million supercomputer that was the size of this building 40 years ago. That's exponential change and that's continuing. So once people wrap, wrap their brains around just like what's implied by this kind of progress, they start being freed of their limiting beliefs of what is possible. And that's my goal. What do you think and how will Liberty embrace these changes and how it will move forward? Yeah, no, it's great. Thank you. It's a great, great, great question. Listen, when we talk about exponential growth, there's multiple components in the process. The first component is the people, right? People, as he mentioned, have to adapt to all the changes, right? So we are hiring the right people, training the right people, you know, making them take risks and do things that they have to leave outside the comfort zone. Second, we have our customers, right? So we got to spend time with our customer, educating our customer not to be afraid of technology and use it for their own benefit where they control technology versus technology controlling them. And at the end, there's actually the work to be done and implementing technology. And that for us as a provider of telecommunication, it's about more capacity, more reliable, better coverage, higher speed, more stability, fiber to the home. All these things put together enable that technology. So we are one part of the puzzle. And I think we're doing it very well. We're going to do a lot more. But if, you, if that part of the puzzle works and its foundation, everything will flow. From Isla Grande Airport, this is Marisa Rivera. And with Liberty Business at the forefront of the movement, the talk was enlightening and a thought-provoking experience offering valuable insights for businesses and individuals alike.